All right, we got Gabriella Dubu Stafford just broke the Canadian and North American uh, record in the 5,000 meters, 1431, I believe. Um, how are you feeling? Good. I'm very, I'm very thrilled. I'm very tired. Uh, that hurt, <laughs> but I'm happy with it. Yeah, like I think somebody pointed out, which is really annoying. That's now two before this race, two races where I ran the number two time in North America behind, you know, Shelby Houlihan at Doha and then Ali Purrier at the Milrose Mile. So two times I like would have run the North American record. So it's fine. It's fun to finally get one. It's yeah. exciting. <laughs> yeah, definitely. And I mean, you guys were behind pace yes. through three kilometers. So yeah. what, what changed? Um, yeah, I mean, we had a plan going in to just kind of like let the race be what it is. Just kind of get to like 3K and then race. And you know, in a 5K, you can get a lot out of yourselves with a, fat, with a good negative split. Um, I feel like that's the best way to run a 5K because if you're grinding too early, it's just hard, especially for a miler. So um, yeah, we just started like racing and that's when the pace kind of dropped. So yeah. Yeah, And you, you got dropped as well for a little bit. I did, bit. yeah, so, like, I got dropped. Th were you thinking, oh, I'll be able to make this up as long as I'm close? Like what's going through your mind when you're getting dropped? Yeah, I mean, I got dropped pretty late which is concerning. It wasn't like a great place to get dropped. So I was feeling a bit sorry for myself, but it's funny because before the race, I was like, my biggest weakness, I, I, you know, like I said with David, like I think a lot of people had me as the favorite going in, but they haven't seen Elise just like absolutely ripping workouts. Like she is fit. And I'm really excited to see what she can do in like a 5K where she's not leading, like pushing the pace from the front. Um, so I knew that the best way that her best chance of beating me was to start dropping 33s and that would be enough where it wouldn't take too much out of her but it would take a lot out of me and that's exactly what she did um and yeah so i don't know i don't know when i reconnected i think 800 to go i was just like okay just like give yourself a shot um yeah and so i just and then i don't know yeah i managed to catch her back up at four a two to go um so yeah like you know Sorry, I don't know what the question was, but... Yeah. <laughs> How, is this the best your kick's ever been, you think? Um, this is definitely the strongest I've been. Mm -hmm. And you know, Jerry always says, strength is speed, strength is speed. So, um, I... <laughs> Sorry, my husband's laughing at me. <laughs> but he says that all the time, and like, the biggest thing is, you know, being as strong as possible. So, at the end, you're not... You have more like of your kick to access and this is definitely the strongest i've ever been so yeah i think so i think this might be the best my kick's ever been we'll see <laughs> so is, your, is your plan to go and run a 3k at worlds yes i think so i'm like may i'm i'm contemplating the 15 um but yeah i just want to make sure we're being smart but i'm happy with how my fitness has come along so definitely the 3k yeah yes. and do you think like are you thinking you can medal based on what you've, you've seen so far in course? Mm -hmm. you know medals never and medal is never guaranteed but it's definitely not out of the question um you know people come out of the woodworks some people don't run fast right until march so like it's always a bit of like you never know what you're going to get at world indoors so yeah but that's that's the plan that's the dream and it would be fun to see, just to see, you know, see if I can do it. Be good. What do you do for the next month between now and then? Back, uh, back up to Flagstaff. Uh, some of the team might be targeting a 10K. Um, so they'll be focusing on that. I'll be focusing on World Indoors. Um, I might help them pace. We will see. Probably no 10K for me. Um, yeah, but back up to Flagstaff and then we'll see. All right. Well, very impressive run today. You. Congratulations. Appreciate it. Appreciate